Hello and welcome back to Fallout 3 with your story loaders in the Redo Mad. Hi, Lord of the First Sarah Major Spiffling. Level 22, Boxes Madman, good as fuck it is 13, and or uh, neutral guy. I suppose I'm supposed to go into tranquility launcher, but I can do some preparations in that regard. Oh by by cockles. But I kinda of want to explore. Hello? Do you have loot? I seek the loot. There's some clipboards and jumpsuits here. Wait, I can do this. Um, which does not reveal the location of said jumpsuit. Um, that's interesting. Okay. What do we have in the lockers? We have cigarettes. Whole cartons of them. Recon armor. That's interesting. Sure, let's grab it. Uh, a locker. Make troublemaker outfit. Nah. Work stuff is weird stuff. It is the recon stuff. The one. The outfits that are used to go into radioactive areas. Oh, not because it had no radiation protection. Hey, hey, bottle, come on. Let's go. Ah. Cement hats. Oh, lots of lockers here. Come with armor, sure. Move. More six, yes. Metal armor, I think not. Hmm, nothing that way. Oh, there's this chamber. Can I break the entire system? No. Of course not. Alright, I don't think there is anywhere else to go. So, let's find this uh, unoccupied lounger and get the fuck in. Seems like a plan. Please stand by. Alright. Standing by. No, that, well, that wasn't nice. Uh, hello? Wait. Ah, that's nice. I'm gonna get them a cheek again. Hello, I would like to steal all your meal. Hey there, sport. Beautiful day, isn't it? Say, you should go talk to Betty. She's waiting for you over on the playground. Have fun, sport. Don't tell my dad is a kid as well. Don't tell Betty is my dad. At least don't tell me that. I'm just going to, you know, do the standard thing for this sort of situation. Check every nook and cranny because there's absolutely nothing I can carry out of here. Can I go into the house? Not yet. Apparently I'm supposed to activate it at the latest spot though. Door to abandoned house. Hello garden gnome. Where do you keep the loot? Can I? Wait, that's the wrong key. No, I cannot turn on the lights. I cannot loot the fridge. <gasps> There's no radioactiveness in the toilet. Wait, 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 wait. Drink it all. Yeah. Oh yeah. Perfectly healthy toilet water. Nothing could be better. Nothing. Except, you know. Loot. But you can't have loot. I'm just a Kitama chick. Kitama chicks don't have loot. Welcome back to Tranquility Lane. Where we're supposed to find Betty, who most certainly is not dead. Hi, are you Betty? Near Doc. Good, Ducky. Are you dad? Don't tell me you're dad. Alright. 
Are you ready? Oh, someone new to play with. What good luck I have lately. I was just starting to get bored. Oh, we're going to have so much fun. Don't turn me into a dog. I'm looking for my father. Have you seen him? Gee, I don't know. What's he like? Uh, he's a scientist. He's looking for Dr. Brown. <laughs> That's your daddy? Oh, we're going to have so much fun. This is going to be the best game ever. My facial expression right now is of pure dread. Uh, okay, I guess. I knew you would. It's a really simple game. All you have to do is make Timmy Newsbomb cry. Why would I want to do that? What kind of game is It'll this? It'll be funny. Come on, you'll see. Make him cry and then come back here and we'll talk some more. Well? You can't do that here. And now you have to pay. Oh, joy! <laughs> There's such joy in paying for my actions. Such joy. Well, guess that's that. I'm just going to do the same conversation and skip through it this time. Hello! Hi there! Oh, someone new to Okay, that's uh, the thunder. Doc, are you dead? Are you dead? Good doggy. Don't tell me you're dead, doggy. Hello. Hello, Dimmy. He's not crying yet. Is that this not sufficient for you, Outlander? Hello. And what? Hiya. Hi, Hi there. I'm Timmy. Want to play? Uh, have you seen my dad? Your dad? Nope, I haven't. Did he get lost? Perhaps. Uh, Betty says I should make you cry. What? No, she didn't. Did she? I don't like her. She's creepy. And she laughs at stuff that isn't funny. Yeah. What can you tell me about the neighborhood? It's okay, I guess. I don't really have nobody to play with. Except for Betty. And she's kind of... Well... She's mean. Tell me about it. None of this is real. It's all some crazy what? experiment. You're weird. So, you, so I heard your parents are getting a divorce because of you're me? a big dumb liar. Yes. <gasps> Don't tell me you're gonna fight me. You can't fight. Hi, Pat. Hello there. Good day Hello. to you. What can you tell me about Timmy Nielsen? Timmy? Oh, he's a good boy. George and I are so proud of him. How I do I make you cry? Says, I don't think military school would do him any good at all. I have half a mind to give her that brochure back and tell her just what she can do with it. Uh, have you seen my dad? No, sweetie, I haven't. I'm sure he'll come looking for you before long, though. Nice day, isn't it? It sure is. But it always is here. That's wonderful. What can you tell me about the neighborhood? Well, George and I have been here, why, as long as I can remember. Uh, this is a pretty convincing simulation. What? Oh, sweetie, maybe you should just run along and play. I think I am. Have a great day. Timmy, can I tell you Hi. about Want your future in the military? No. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. Ooh, these are nice wheels. I bet they would explode nicely, indeed. Hello, Garden Room. Rockwell Residence. Where did Timmy go again? It's 
so team moving somewhere it did not perfectly register in my mind exactly where he went probably not into the backyard because is this really how you do fences sir? this is not how you simulate fences can I go in here? no I saw Timmy talking to her again I don't want him near her George she's crazy and I don't want it you you don't belong here you're not supposed to be here it's not real none of it it needs to end the suffering must end hey, finally someone who knows what's going on how to get out of here we're not really here we're not really talking it's all made up make believe we're sleeping dreaming the dream became a nightmare it has to end. It just has to. But we're not in charge. He is. And he doesn't want us to wake up. Who are you talking about? He calls himself Betty now, but he's still the same. He can put on a new face all he likes, but underneath he's still evil. Braun. Bastard thinks because he helped create this place, he's God here. But I know he still uses the fail-safe terminal. I know it. What fail-safe? It's in the abandoned house. He doesn't want us going in there because he's afraid we might find it. It's the only terminal to the outside. The only way to shut the whole thing down. You've got to find it. And influencing him. So you don't have to make Timmy cry. Okay. I'll have another chat with him about Why don't you look where it. you're going? I'm sure he was only being polite. What can hey, I George? do for you, sport? Uh... Who is Betty? Betty? Well, she's Betty. You know, you really shouldn't keep her waiting. I'm not gonna make you sound cry. Hello, Miss Divers. I'm gonna go see directly if I can do anything about this situation. Do you know the things I kept? Hmm. But he's not willing to tell me about it. So maybe he does know. Hmm, I probably need something to... Some way to activate the gnome then. Alright. <clears throat> Where did Timmy even go? Can I activate you? No. Did his residence. I would even assume that this place was real. Makes no sense. You're supposed to be making Tim when you win the game. Where's my father? Oh, don't worry about that now. There are things to do. Tell me about this place. Maybe later. First, I want to see how you get along with Timmy. Who are you? Don't you worry about that. You just go have fun with Timmy. Damn it, Brown. What am I supposed to be doing you again? You need to go find Timmy Newsbum and make him cry. It'll be funny. You'll see. Fine. Tell Timmy I said hi. No, I can do that much. I suppose that maybe when I am unable to strike against Betty, maybe just maybe, hello, Timmy is not under the same protection. For example, we must consider the fact that apparently someone wants someone named Betty wants Timmy to be punched. Or at least made you cry, and quite frankly, I think violence may or may not be the most optimal solution. Hiya. Hi. 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 You're gonna get it now. Am I? No. Congratulations! I have made Timmy cry. And on that f fantastic note, I will end the episode, so thanks for watching, I'll see you next time.
next time on Fallout 3. I hate to break it to you, but I saw your husband kissing some other woman. What a horrible thing to say. Is that your idea of a joke? No. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. <laughs>